Our bodies are incredible machines, constantly working to keep us healthy and functioning. Every day they perform countless tasks that we often take for granted. Just like a car needs fuel, our bodies need essential nutrients to operate correctly. Without the right fuel, our bodies can't perform at their best. One of these vital nutrients is potassium, an electrolyte that plays a crucial role in many bodily functions. It's found in a variety of foods, including bananas, avocados, and spinach. From keeping our hearts beating regularly to helping our muscles move, potassium is essential for our overall health and well-being. It supports physical activities like kayaking and hiking. Potassium acts like an electrical messenger, carrying signals between our cells and tissues. These signals are crucial for our daily activities, even those as simple as typing on a laptop. These signals control everything from our heartbeat and blood pressure to muscle contractions and nerve function. Whether you're running on a beach or playing soccer, potassium is at work. Without enough potassium, our bodies can experience a range of problems, some mild and some quite serious. Fatigue and muscle cramps are common signs of low potassium levels. This is where hypokalemia comes in. Hypokalemia is a condition characterized by low levels of potassium in the blood, which can lead to severe health issues if not addressed. Hypokalemia is the medical term for low potassium levels in the blood. Potassium is an essential mineral that plays a crucial role in various bodily functions, including muscle contractions, nerve signals, and fluid balance. Even a slight dip in potassium can disrupt the delicate balance within our bodies, affecting everything from our heart rhythm to our muscle function, leading to a cascade of potential health issues. These can range from mild symptoms like muscle weakness and cramps to more severe complications, such as irregular heartbeats and paralysis. In simple terms, hypokalemia is like having a low battery in your phone. Just as a low battery can hinder your phone's performance, your phone might still work, but it won't function as well as it should. Similarly, your body might still operate, but not at its optimal level. Similarly, when your body doesn't have enough potassium, it can't perform its best. This can impact your daily activities, making you feel tired and weak. Potassium is found in many of the foods we eat, such as bananas, oranges, and leafy greens. And our bodies work hard to maintain a healthy balance of this important mineral. Drinking plenty of water and eating a balanced diet can help. However, certain medical conditions, medications, or even lifestyle factors can disrupt this balance, leading to hypokalemia. It's important to be aware of these factors and consult a healthcare provider if you experience symptoms. There are many reasons why someone might develop hypokalemia. Sometimes it's as simple as not getting enough potassium in our diet. This is more common in individuals who don't eat a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, and other potassium-rich foods. In other cases, hypokalemia can be a side effect of certain medications, such as diuretics or water pills and laxatives. These medications can increase potassium loss through urine or stool. Certain medical conditions such as kidney disease or hormonal imbalances can also interfere with the body's ability to regulate potassium levels, leading to hypokalemia. Section 4. Recognizing the Signs Hypokalemia often develops gradually, and mild cases may not cause any noticeable symptoms. However, as potassium levels continue to drop, you may start to experience warning signs such as muscle weakness or cramps, fatigue and weakness, constipation, frequent urination, and increased thirst. If you experience any of these symptoms, it's essential to consult with your doctor. They can perform a simple blood test to determine if you have hypokalemia and recommend the appropriate treatment. Section 5. Treatment and Prevention The good news is that hypokalemia is treatable, and in many cases, preventable. With the right approach, you can manage and even avoid this condition. Treatment for hypokalemia typically involves increasing your potassium intake through diet or supplements. Consuming potassium-rich foods like bananas, oranges, and spinach can be very beneficial. Your doctor can recommend the appropriate dosage of potassium supplements based on your individual needs. It's important to follow their guidance to avoid any potential complications. In severe cases, intravenous potassium may be necessary to quickly restore potassium levels to a normal range. This is usually done in a hospital setting under close medical supervision. Preventing hypokalemia often involves making simple lifestyle changes, such as eating a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, and other potassium-rich foods. 
regularly including these in your meals can make a big difference. Staying hydrated by drinking plenty of water, especially during hot weather or exercise, is also crucial. Dehydration can exacerbate potassium loss, so it's important to keep your fluid levels up. Additionally, talking to your doctor about the potential side effects of any medications you are taking can help you manage your potassium levels more effectively. Some medications can affect potassium balance. Remember, hypokalemia is a manageable condition, and by taking steps to maintain healthy potassium levels, you can help keep your body functioning at its best. Regular checkups and a proactive approach to your health can go a long way.